Welcome to Rasa Taste. Today I am going to show you how to make South Indian mixture. The ingredients required are Basin flour, Rice flour, Cashews, Peanuts, Roasted gram dal, Potato, Chilli powder, Salt, Poha thick type, Curry leaves, Hing powder, Water and Oil. The quantity of all the ingredients depends on your taste. You can increase or decrease the quantity of the ingredients according to your liking. Let's start making the mixture. First, I am going to add basin flour. I have taken 6 ladles of basin flour. To this, we can add 1 to 1 and a half ladle of rice flour add salt chilli powder the quantity depends on your taste and hing powder add water and make it into a Batter. We are going to do omopodi first. Now I have mixed all the ingredients and the consistency should be like this. Little thick, not very thin. Now take a press with small holes. The omopodi press. Fill the press with the dough. And press it. Now keep the flame on medium and gently turn it to the other side. Fry it till it becomes golden brown in color. Now it has become brown in color. You can remove the omapadi from the oil. I have taken the same batter in a small bowl. Pour little more water. We are going to make kara bundi now with the same batter but it should be little more thin than the omapodi batter. I have added little water and the consistency like should be like this like the idli batter and you need a ladle like this with holes to make the bundis. Now Add the batter, keep it above the oil and that you can tap it or you can spread it like this also. Once the bundi is become brown, you can remove it from the oil. Now kara bundi is ready. Homa pudi is also ready. Now before frying the peanuts, Roasted gram dal, mix chilli powder, salt and hing powder together and make it into a mixture like this. Now, now add the peanuts in the oil. Let it get fried. Now it has fried well, remove it from the oil. The quantity of peanuts depend upon your taste. If you want, if you like it, you can add more peanuts. Now, add the chilli powder, salt and hing powder mixture and mix well immediately when it is still hot. Then transfer it into a separate container. In the same way, fry the cashews, the roaster gram dal, poha separately and then mix the chilli powder chilli salt powder mixture into the fried ingredients now i am roasting the <coughs> roaster gram dal after frying everything peel the skin of the potato and take a potato slicer and like how you slice for the 
chips you can make potato chips and fry it with once it's in golden brown color you can remove the chips then spread the chili powder mix well i have fried all the ingredients cashews so I roast a gram the poha everything peanuts also and applied the and I have spread the chili powder mix also and kept it separately. Potato chips also is ready. The omapodi is ready and karabundi is ready. And curry leaves also we need to fry it in oil and keep it aside. Now everything is fried and ready to be mixed and made it into a mixture. Now break the warmer pudding into small pieces. Potato chips also you can break it into pieces, small pieces. Now mix all the fried ingredients together. Mix everything well in a large vessel. Now, now spicy and tasty mixture is ready. Now tasty and spicy mixture is ready. Hope you enjoy watching this. Please subscribe to our channel Rasa Taste and give the video a thumbs up. Thank you.